hi guys yeah, welcome back to my channel in today's video tutorial i'm going to be showing you guys how to create and verify bybit account on mobile i will guide you through the step-by-step -step process of setting up and verifying your bybit account on your mobile device bybit is a popular cryptocurrency derivatives exchange that offers you a user-friendly platform for trading and managing your digital assets Creating and verifying your account is a straightforward process and I will show you guys how to do it easily. So guys, if you want to know how to do it, just make sure you hang on to the end of this video. And if this video is helpful to you, please consider liking, subscribing and leaving a comment as that will help grow this channel. So guys, let's get started. So guys, the first step you have to take now is to get started with Bybit. And for you to get started with Bybit, you have to download and install the Bybit app into your phone. For you to download and install the Bybit app into your phone, what you have to do now is to go over to your Play Store and that's if you're using an Android device but if you're using an ios device or an iphone what you have to do is to go over to your app store so guys let me go back to my play store since i'm using an android device in this video tutorial today so let me tap on my play store real quick so let me tap on it so guys once you tap on your play store on your app store what you have to do right the way now is actually to search for buy beat and for you to search for buy beat you have to tap on the search bar there at the top you can see it so let me tap on it then what you have to do next now is to type in buy beat so let me type in buy beat buy beat so guys after that you tap on the search icon below so let me tap on it so guys you can see the buy beat app right there let me tap on it so you see it clearly so guys you can see the app more clearly you can see the logo you can see the name buy beat buy bitcoin and crypto so guys now what you have to do now is to download and install this app and for you to do that you have to tap on where you can see install you can see it there so let me tap on it but guys if i do that you can see that this app has a star rating of 4.5 over 5 which means people are actually saying good things about it let me slide to the left to show you guys more so guys can see here 10 million downloads 10 million persons are actually using this app right now so guys all these parameters right here will tell you that people are actually using this app and it's giving them their required results so guys what they have to do is to tap on install so guys let me tap on install right away so guys now you can see the Bybit app have started downloading as you can see there is at 9% so what you have to do is to wait till it gets to 100% then after it's done downloading it's going to start installing automatically so guys let's just shoot a few seconds so guys you can see it has gotten to 100% it's going to start installing automatically like I said so guys now you can see it has started installing automatically so let's just shoot a few seconds as well so guys now you can see the Bybit app is done downloading and installing so what you have to do right away is to tap on open so let me tap on open right away so guys now you can see the Bybit app has opened up this is the first interface you're going to see if you're using the app for the first time so guys this is what it looks like so guys now the first step you have to take now is actually to tap on where you can see sign up you can see there the arrow is pointing at it so let me tap on this right away so guys now you can see here is the next step you can see what's written there at the top create bybit account so guys you can actually create your bybit account using your email or you can use your phone number you can see that inside code area right there you can see email is chosen if you want to use your phone number what you have to do next tap on mobile number let me tap on it so you see it so guys now you can see mobile number has been chosen so if you want to use your phone number you can go ahead and also you can use your google account you can see it down there you can see it down there the arrow is pointing at it you can use your google account if you want but guys i'm going to be using my email to create this account so let me tap on email again so guys what i have to do now is to impute my email so let me impute my email right away so guys now you can see i've imputed my email so the next step now you have to do now is to set your password you can see where it is written password you have to set a strong password for yourself so guys let me go ahead now to impute my password let me create a password so guys now you can see the criteria of creating a password the password must contain 8 to 30 characters so it must not be less than 8 you can see the second criteria at least one lowercase letter that means small letter it must have a small letter alphabet the third criteria is at least one uppercase letter which is the capital letter so it must have one capital letter alphabet and the last criteria is at least one number so guys make sure you impute a number a figure in it so guys let me go ahead now to create my password real quick so guys now you can see i've imputed my email and also imputed my password so guys now the next step you have to take now is to go over to the referral code you can see it's optional but guys this is where you're going to do me a favor i want you to use my referral code you can see my referral code on the screen you can also get it in the description box down below so guys i want you to use my referral code by using my referral code you're going to be getting a 10 percent discount on your trading fee once you create your bybit account and also you're going to be getting a commission from bybit that is worth over 500 dollars 
Guys, I'm also going to be getting a small commission from Bybit if you use my referral code. So it's a win-win for both of us. So guys, you can just get a pen now to write down the referral code so you can use it later or you can make a screenshot to save it so that you can use it later whenever you're creating your own Bybit account. So guys, that being said, let me go ahead now to impute my referral code. Let me impute it right away. Let me type it in. So guys now you can see i've imputed my referral code so guys what you have to do next now is to make sure you actually tick that box there you can see that box on the left hand side you can see it there after ticking the box what you have to do next is to tap on sign up you can see where sign up is so guys let me tap on sign up right away so guys now you can see it's loading so guys, what you have to do next now is to slide to complete this puzzle. So you have to move the puzzle to where it's going to fit in this space. So let me do that real quick. So guys, now you can see success. So it's going to take us to the next page. So guys, now you can see verification code has been sent to our email. You can see what is right there. Verification code sent. Please check your inbox or your spam folder. So guys, what I have to do now is to go over to my Gmail account. I need to go over to my inbox to get the code that was sent to my email. So guys, let me do that real quick. Let me split my screen. Then let me tap on my Gmail app. So guys, I've gotten the code. So let me go ahead now to impute the code right away. So guys, now you can see I've imputed the code. Now it's loading. Wow, guys, can see successful registration. Welcome to Bybit. So guys, now you can see we have successfully verified our email. So guys, now the next step you have to take now is actually to verify your account. So guys, what you have to do now is to tap on where it is written verify. You can see it there. You can skip to get into the app, then verify later. So guys, let me tap on skip. Let me just tap on skip. So guys, now you can see this is the home page of the Bybit account. This is the home page of my Bybit account I just created right now. So guys, now you can also see verify now. So guys, now for you to actually verify your account, what you have to do now is to tap on verify now. So guys, let me tap on it right away. So guys, if I tap on it, you can see what's written there. Complete verification to deposit and win over five thousand dollars welcome gift. So guys, now you can see that's because I actually used the referral code. So guys, let me go ahead now to tap on verify now. Let me tap on it real quick. So guys, you can see this account is unverified. It's here to be verified. So guys, now the next step you have to take now is to tap on verify now. You can see it down there. So let me tap on it. So guys, now you can see here is the next step. You can see what was written here. Verify your identity. So guys, what you have to do now is to choose your country. You can see it there. You can see where the arrow is pointing. My country is already chosen automatically. So guys, now you can see the document type that you can actually use to verify your identity. You can see we have five options here. The first one there is your BVN. The second one there is your ID card, which is your national ID card, your NIN card. What the third one is your driver's license. Then the fourth one is your passport, which can be your international passport. Then the last one is your resident permit. So guys, now whichever one that you have available, you can go ahead to choose that option. But guys, in this video today, I'm going to be using the first option, which is BVN. Your BVN is your bank verification number. So guys, the easiest way to get your BVN, your bank verification number, is to go over to your bank app. Whichever bank they're using, just go over to the mobile app. You'll be able to get your BVN. You're going to be able to see it there in your app. So guys, now once you've got your BVN, then you're good to go. And in case you have the second option, which is your ID card, your national ID card, your NIN card, you can actually use it and it's going to be successful. What you have to do is to get the card, then you'll be required to take a picture of the card, the front and the back of the card, then you're good to go. And the same goes to the driver's license, the passport, and the resident permit. You're going to be required to take a picture of them. But in this video, I'm going to be using the first option, which is BVN. So guys, let me tap on BVN right away. So let me tap on it. Then what you have to do next now is to tap on confirm. You can see it there below. So let me tap on it. So guys, now you can see what's written here. Allow Bybit to take pictures and record video. So let me tap on allow. So guys, now you can see it's loading. So guys, now you can see the next step. You can see what's written there. I'm a residence of. So if you're a residence of US, what you have to do is to tap on the second option. But if you don't reside in US, what you have to do is to tap on the first option, which is non-US resident. So guys, let me choose the first option since I don't live in the US. So let me tap on it. So guys, after that, what you have to do now is to tap on continue. So let me tap on continue right away. So guys, now you can see here is the next step. You can see what's written there. Verify your identity. It will only take two minutes. So guys, you can see what they need of you. You have to provide your profile details such as your name, your basic information. Then the second one, you have to take a selfie. You have to take a picture of yourself, a passport of yourself using your phone camera. Then you have to upload it. So guys, it's very easy. So guys, for you to continue with that, what you have to do is to tap on continue. You can see continue down there. So let me tap on continue right away. 
so guys now you can see here is the next step you can see what was written there profile details verify and complete your personal information so guys you can see the first one there you have to impute your country as you can see there my country has been automatically placed there then over to the second one i have to impute my bvn right here then the last one i have to impute my last name which is also my son name so guys let me do this right away let me impute my bvn and my last name so guys now you can see i've imputed my bvn and my last name though i blurred it for security reasons so guys after that what you have to do now is to tap on continue so let me tap on continue right away so guys now you can see here is the next step here you have to position your face so you can take a selfie of yourself more like a passport so guys position your face so it fits the frame so guys let me do that right away so guys you can see they're asking me to position my face and they're asking me to look straight into the camera so let me do that so guys now you can see my face has been captured you can see what's written there your face scan is complete so guys now you can see what's written here let me get to read it the verification status the system is reviewing your documents this will take about two minutes so guys, let's just wait for a few seconds wow guys you can see what's written there verification status completed our account has been verified wow guys can i see my account has been verified you can see level one verified so guys let me go back to my profile now to show you guys that my account has actually been verified let me tap on my profile icon so guys now you can see here is my profile page so guys now you can see that my account has been verified you can see that verified mark the tick right there the green tick you can see there the arrow is pointing at it so guys now my account has been verified so guys now i've been able now to show you guys how you can create and verify your bybit account on your mobile device so guys now i've come to the end of this video and i believe this video was helpful to you if it was make sure you consider liking subscribing and leaving a comment as that will help this channel see you in our next upload on tutorials like this on bybit bye peace